As a kid, I was starved for acceptance. I think going throughout school, I very much found myself typically more on the outside crowd rather than the inside crowd. And, and therefore, I, I, I was starved for acceptance. And when anyone would even show a hint of acceptance, and I gravitated towards that because I wanted it so bad. Now, in hindsight, um, I you know, can see fairly clearly that a lot of that stemmed from me having absolutely no concept, no knowledge, no grasp of the gospel itself. In other words, I didn't grasp my acceptance on, on any other plane, so I needed to be accepted on the only thing that I could see, which, which were my peers. And as we're continuing to look at this devotional series about what it looks like for us adults to become like little children, we have so much to learn from them because little children, you know, toddlers, right? They grasp their, their unconditional acceptance apart from their performance, I think much better than we do. For instance, when a child has a temper tantrum, um, you know, five minutes later, like they're not afraid to come to the parent and, and ask for something. If a toddler has a dirty diaper, they're not embarrassed to approach the parent. But with, with us, it can often be a different story. So let's turn, we're gonna, I'm gonna kind of summarize the story in Galatians chapter two, verses 10 through 13, that very much ties into this concept. So Galatians two, 10 through 13, is a scene in which Paul, the apostle Paul confronts uh, Peter. So Peter had been eating with a certain group of uh, people who were of a different um, race than he was. But when uh, some of his cronies, his, his friends of, of, a, of his same race, had come, he began to pull away and he stopped eating with the Gentiles. Now, it's interesting. So Paul, in his rebuke, his correction of Peter, he doesn't just, you know, tell Peter, um, hey, you need to eat with these people or, you know, stop doing this. He says, Peter, you are not walking in step with the gospel. I think that's very telling because... What Paul is saying is, in that moment, uh, Peter's desire um, to be accepted by this certain group of people was a direct result of him not grasping his acceptance by the gospel. And so when you and I um, don't embrace becoming like little children and accepting our unconditional acceptance in, in our vertical relationship, what happens is we seek to steal acceptance in our horizontal relationships. And so it's hard to be ministers of the gospel when we are not walking in step with the gospel or grasping the gospel ourselves. You see, uh, Peter was meant to be a conduit in which the gospel was spreading to others, and yet because he wasn't embodying it or grasping it, really his ministry in this specific instance was failing to go forward. And so my encouragement for us is to, to really to grasp, to become like a little child, let's reflect and meditate on how a child really grasps this unconditional acceptance apart from their performance. And so I wanna leave you with this question. What is an area of your life right now that you are, are acting or walking in a way in which you are treating God's acceptance of you as conditional?